Today we're in chapter 7 of Leviticus. This chapter is all about laws that govern the children of Israel. Sacrifices, things approved, forbidden, eating fat of sacrifices, the use of blood. It's the sacrificial laws. They would worship by sacrifice. Sacrifices would allow them to be forgiven. They made vows by sacrifice, consecrated their property by sacrifice, even give thanks by sacrifice. Reconciled to God, obviously, by the sacrificial laws. It's about boundaries, about do's and don'ts, the whole process of how you serve the Lord. And the Lord still has boundaries, but the law is now written on our heart. Listen to this passage of scripture from Hebrews chapter 10. It says this, This is the covenant that I will make with them. After these days, says the Lord, I will put my law into their hearts and into their minds I will write them. Then he adds, their sins and their lawless deeds I will remember no more. So now the Holy Spirit leads and convicts. His word corrects and instructs. Our sacrifice is once and forever, the Lamb of God who takes away our sin. Jesus himself says it the best. It is finished. So the sacrificial laws, all the do's and don'ts, the way they worship, now comes together in the person of Jesus Christ as we're led by his spirit, as we're forgiven by his sacrifice, and as we're instructed by his word. Leviticus chapter 7, well, once again, pointing to the ultimate lawgiver and the one who finishes the law himself, Jesus Christ. <music>